This is a Titan's first product, the Hyperion Development Kit. Um, it's a 20G product and we have a roadmap for a 40G and 100G product. Um, it's illustrated here in a half height, half length PCI Gen 3 card with a processor connected to a host system, typically a server based system uh, with multiple cores communicating with the processor. We pre-compile rules, regexes, regular expressions, put them onto the card and then we send data for processing. If there's a match in the data, we get a response back and it's up to the user's application to manage that data in whatever application they have, whether it's a cybersecurity application or a big data type application. This demo illustrates the performance of this system. We overload it with data and we flatline 20G throughput all the way along. This is our 20G product. Typically, software systems will start falling over. This system can handle it because of its parallel architecture. The product is also available as licensable IP for, for system on chip architectures, but you can buy it as a development kit or you can buy it as a standalone board as well. Our key selling points are performance. Over the whole range from a consumer product all the way to the highest end next generation firewall, we're incredibly scalable in terms of the performance we deliver. So we're performance leaders. And when I say performance, I don't just mean the speed and keeping up with the line rate, which we do. For content pen inspection, it's the most difficult of problems. So it's not good enough to do an exact match of what's happening. It's not good enough to have a ternary. That means some things are don't care. So I care about that word, but not about that one. It's not enough. You have to do regular expression matching. And that means if it's your name or mine or any kind of a word, if it's spelled, misspelled, you identify it, there might be spaces. You might look for repetitions. There's a very rich context, a very rich syntax that can be used if you really want to understand content. We have the ability to do that, and we can scale it from one gigabit to 100 gigabit beyond. The product is particularly scalable. We're going to achieve it with highly parallel processing units, regular expression processing units. The processing units, each one's in a cluster, plus it has a processing pipeline. We have multiple clusters, so you can choose to have perhaps two processing units in one chip, four, eight, 16, that's what we'll be rolling out in the fall, and then beyond that. So you have the number of clusters, you have the data path width in the cluster, and you have the speed of the cluster. So right there in a single chip, you have enormous variability in terms of performance. And of course, you can have more than one chip, and you could have an array of chips. There's an enormous range like that. If we come back to what we can do in a single chip, we're riding the semiconductor wave. The product we're using right now uses really a moderate size chip. If we go to a little bit bigger chip, later in the fall, we'll go from our 40 up to 80 gigabits and 100 gigabits per second. In the ensuing semiconductor generation, a year away at this point, we'll be going to 200 gigabit per second. So we have the only regular X acceleration roadmap that rides the semiconductor wave and is going to take advantage of that. We're at the show because the, the number of, the, uh, of our customers are here, both our partner vendors in terms of the firewall companies and the other companies here, and we hope to both do, engage in our partnerships with them and also to be engaging with our customers and selling our products. And in fact, it's, it's running very well for us, and in fact, We've had our product sales at the conference itself, so we couldn't be happier about that.